if you willingly put yourself in a situation where you're more likely to get a disease, why should well, you be surprised? Why haven't you banned that upset, person yet? Or upset or entitled to sympathy when you get sick. <laughs> I like the fact that um, your name on YouTube is Don Quixote because it does kind of um, accurately describe your level of delusion. Um, <laughs> the... <laughs> The, the the fact that the idea that uh, you do something that uh, makes you more, you know, more likely to get a disease and therefore you shouldn't get sympathy is just ridiculous. Like, yeah, exactly. Like, <laughs> you fucking smoked once? Fuck you. No, you no lung AIDS? cancer treatment for you. Screw you. To be fair, people do absolutely treat smokers that way. That's true, but that's because people are inhumane pieces of shit. <laughs> Like, yeah. you would, you, but you know, one thing conservatives would never do this with is people who volunteer to go to war. If you volunteer to go to Rude war, hatch. you are setting yourself up to be, to be injured, so we actually shouldn't help any veterans ever. Right? I mean, so true. you're making yourself likelier to be injured. There's no likelier way to get shot by a gun than to willingly go into a war zone, you dumb fuck fight for your country you just basically let yourself get killed who cares if you have a punctured lung <laughs> war uh, is different because yeah. it helps others Are homosexuality you kidding me? benefits no one homosexuality <laughs> benefits me How, you're literally I, trying to argue I, that I war is good <laughs> of homosexuality. trying homosexuality to argue for war yeah them. war is good versus gayness is bad the more the more homosexuality there is, the more I benefit. Me specifically. Yes, this exactly. True. Yes. Um, and and Mark D just want to address something here in chat. Uh, uh, veteran services kind of suck, from what I uh, what I've heard. Absolutely, and I I absolutely believe in better veteran services. My point is just that people are very uh, people are very quick to agree on the fact that we should have better veteran services as soon as uh, it's brought up. Right. I absolutely agree that they're not good enough. Right. However, people agree on that, but not other things. Um, Lossy, I think war is a great example, but radiology is another great example, right? Uh, yeah, exactly. Being homosexual makes you happy. Having gay sex makes a lot of people happy. Just, just ask my entire community. All right. They, where would they be without um gay sex? They do. They do be a little fruity. We have to increase the yeah, fruitiness clearly, coefficient. Clearly you haven't felt the touch of another man. Um... <laughs> but war, you never said war itself was good? Well, that's the thing, right? Does it matter? Does it matter that... that... That whether war itself is is good or not. I mean, if if the war is fought for unjust causes, do we leave the people who went to die in that you know who 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 went to give their lives in that war just leave them disabled and helpless for the rest of their lives? Do we? Smoking does make some people happy. Well, I believe that we should help everyone. You don't give up your right to life when you smoke cigarettes. You don't give up your right to life when you fuck people. Also, there are perfectly <laughs> safe ways to have gay sex. Um, don't let this man scare you, all you gay viewers. Again, don't um, be like Don Quixote. Don't be delusional. Don't be delusional. Yeah. Which, you know, obviously, at the end of the book, he, he gets to be happy in his strange delusions. But I feel like you're not really getting that happiness out of this. I feel like you live in kind of a... A strange, scary world where gay people are out to get you. I hate the moral semiotics so of since homosexuality. When, since when did I did I become a sex ed teacher? Since this this fucker showed up in my chat. All right, this is like that. It, I'm just, Look, I'm just kind of me, gay, in in the one microsecond that this person breathed in chat. K Klein immediately went to university, got a whole degree, and got a certification to become a sex ed teacher. Pretty much, yeah. Just well, to spite him. It's just that I seem like a sex ed teacher in comparison to this absolute moron. Um, 
I'm sorry, Don Quixote. I'm sure you'll find peace. I'm sure you'll one day come around. I'm sure you'll meet the man of your dreams and then you'll be fine. Um, no one forces you into a situation where you are likely to be harmed or get sick. It's your own decision to put yourself in that situation. Anatomy, who is my girlfriend, by the way, fantastic point. Have you ever sat in a car? Have you ever sat in a fucking car? Walk. <laughs> it's safer. Fucking walk. I can't because I live in suburbia, but unfortunately. But you're putting yourself in risk. If you end up in a car crash, stealthy, it's if you really end up in a your car crash, fault, you don't actually. deserve, you you are don't deserve help. You are asking for it. You don't deserve help. If you uh, if you get out of bed, you're uh, putting yourself at risk of dying in literally any fashion. And if you stay in bed, you're also putting yourself at risk of dying. Oh, have you ever yeah, really? You could get bed sores, which could become infected. I I I you know I I have you ever walked down a fucking set of stairs? No, actually, that's too dangerous for me. Well, like, did you know that the, the most common? Yeah, one of the most common ways of dying by falling is falling from a distance of four feet or less. Absolutely. And the stairs it's are the because most dangerous you thing. Are you going to fall from four feet or less? It's specifically because when you do that, you tend to land on your head and snap your neck. Risk yeah. of falling downstairs only apply to the disabled children and the elderly. Does that imply that if a full-grown <laughs> man falls down the stairs, do they deserve no sympathy? Uh, oh, it's okay when grandma does it, but when grandma's <laughs> son does it, nah. Uh, 